American cities ramp up security around places of worship following Israel attacks, and assure residents there are no credible threats, while assuring Americans there are no credible threats locally, cities throughout the United States are ramping up security around houses of worship after the large-scale attack by Gaza militants on Israel on Saturday. The FBI and the Department of Homeland Security issued public safety concern bulletins Saturday to state and local law enforcement and said. They are monitoring for any impact on the U.S. domestic threat environment, a law enforcement official said. So far, the agencies said there was no current specific intelligence indicating a threat to the United States. The increased vigilance in the U.S. comes after Gaza militants launched a surprise attack on Israel Saturday morning, firing thousands of rockets and entering Israel by land, sea, and air. Israel then launched airstrikes on Gaza while its forces clashed on the ground with Hamas fighters. In Israel, at least 300 people have died and thousands of others are wounded, officials said. In Gaza, at least 232 Palestinians have died and more than 1,600 are wounded, the Palestinian Health Ministry said. New York City Mayor Eric Adams on Saturday said there are no specific or credible threats against the Jewish community in the city, which is home to the largest Jewish population in the world outside Israel. I have directed the NYPD to deploy additional resources to Jewish communities and houses of worship citywide to ensure that our communities have the resources they need to make sure everyone feels safe, Adams said. Meanwhile, New York Governor Kathy Hochul said she's working with Israel's acting consul general in New York and the U.S. Embassy in Jerusalem to aid in the return of New Yorkers currently in Israel. She added as a precaution, she has directed the New York State Police to work with local law enforcement to ensure Jewish community spaces are safe. Across TH